you might have noticed these plus one buttons next to your search results when searching in Google. These buttons can tell Google that you like this link and essentially recommend it to all friends connected to you through Google's new social networking service, Google+. When you plus one a link, and when someone connected to you does a similar search, any website you have plus one will appear at the top of the search results for your friends. Your goal is to get as many people to plus one your website. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add this button to your website in iWeb. So to add a Google Plus One button, first visit the Google Plus One page. You can pause this video to type in the URL you see here, or you can do a search for Google Plus One and click on the Google Plus One button result. Next, you will see a link on this page that says Get the Code. Click on that link. On the next page, the first thing you will do is choose the size of the plus one button that you like best. You can then select your language. Next, click on the Advanced Options button and type in your URL in the URL to plus one field. I have noticed that it is best to include HTTP colon slash slash and www in this field. Now we can highlight all of the code and copy it. Open up your site in iWeb and drag and drop an HTML snippet onto the page. Paste the code that you just copied. You should now be able to see your Google Plus One button. If you want to put the button on another page or pages of your website, then paste the code in another HTML snippet on that page. If you want to leave the URL to your home page, you can do so, otherwise you can add the page extension to the URL that is already typed in there. If you paste the code and you don't see anything at all, first, make sure you type your URL in with HTTP colon slash slash and www. You can also try publishing your site to the web to see if it becomes live once the site is published. I just want to show you what happens when you either leave the URL field blank or do not include HTTP colon slash slash and www. You will notice that the HTML snippet shows up as this huge box which I am now dragging along with my mouse. I could minimize this box until it is the size of the plus one button, however that can take me a while. So just take note of these things if the button is not showing up for you. Otherwise, that is how you add a Google Plus One button to an iWeb website. Be sure to check out our other helpful iWeb tips and tricks videos, which are located in the SEO for iWeb walkthrough video tutorial, or at our blog at ragesw.com blog.